Hi there, uh, my name's James and I've got an idea to start a small backyard based urban farming project in the city of Brisbane. Uh, basically myself and a group of volunteers would build a series of vegetable gardens in some unused backyards in an area of Brisbane. Uh, we'd use intensive farming techniques to grow as much food as we can in the smallest space possible and then we'd sell or donate this produce back to the local community in a not-for-profit system. I believe that the current food system of shipping food halfway across the country or even the world is uh, not only fragile but incredibly environmentally destructive and I'd, I'd like to demonstrate there's other ways of doing this. Um, I've spent the last 18 months or so working on small organic farms uh, in South America, Canada, Hawaii and Australia um, to sort of build up the skills and the knowledge that I think I need to start this project. Uh, I've even worked with a few groups in Montreal that were, that were doing a similar backyard urban farming project and, um, and I've seen how powerful this sort of idea can be. So first of all, I'll be recruiting a handful of volunteers. I'll be finding a, an area of Brisbane that's suitable for the project. Uh, I'll be door knocking and pamphleting that, that area to find some suitable unused backyards. Uh, we'll then be soil testing the backyards that we do find to make sure that they're safe to grow food in. Um, we'd then plant the backyards and use intensive farming techniques to grow as much as we can in the smallest sp space possible. Um, the produce that we do grow would be divided up with some going back to the property owners as a kind of a lease repayment, uh, some going uh, to residents in the local community uh, through a food basket system and some would be sold through a farm stand for other people that wanted to come in and buy the fresh produce. During the fundraising campaign, I'm going to be riding a bike from Brisbane down to Melbourne and then catching a ferry across the Bass Strait and riding around Tasmania as well. Uh, in an effort to bring attention to the ridiculous amount of uh, travel that food does before it gets to your plate, I'm going to be dressing myself up as a giant carrot. So that's going to be entertaining for you guys and embarrassing for me. But uh, no, it's, it's going to be fun and um, I'm going to be dropping in on a heap of organic farms along the way and sort of uh, seeing what they're growing, how they're growing it and uh, documenting what I can. Um, the trip should probably take about six or seven weeks and it's about two and a half thousand kilometers. Um, if you're interested in following the trip, I'm going to be posting some updates along the way with a couple of photos and videos and um, I've made a bit of a website if you want to have a look it's uh, freewheelingfarmer.com okay so to get my project off the ground I think I'm going to need about three thousand dollars to begin with um, that's going to cover the cost of some basic hand tools soil testing seed seedlings compost mulch and, uh, and other sort of garden supplies um, if I can raise more, I'm going to look at starting off, kick, kicking off a stage two of the project, which will be things like uh, making our own compost, uh, collecting rainwater for, for watering, um, maybe buying some more advanced equipment like a motorized rototiller to make it easier to till the soil, um, and maybe even a small shade house that we can grow some seedlings in, things like that. Um, if you don't feel like donating or you can't but would prefer to come down and be involved instead that would also be great. Um, uh, I'll be looking for volunteers when I come back. Um, yeah, probably be having a working bee or two once at the, at the beginning once we, uh, once we need to set the gardens up. So you can come down and help with that. Um, or even if you just, uh, you've got some gardening advice or some tips on areas around Brisbane that you think would be a good fit for the, for the project, that'd be great too. Uh, as a final note, I just wanted to acknowledge all the great work that other groups are doing around the world and, and here in Australia. 
for um, towards improving our food systems and reducing the environmental impact. And uh, I highly encourage you to find out if there's anything else happening in your area. Um, get involved or uh, give them some support where you can. Thanks.